because I have men who are willing to even marry. Get you right to. now. I tell you, yes, that. right now, and mm. they're well off. They're yeah. whatever yeah. they are. I'm not going to tell you stay home and you'll meet a man. No. no. Can you connect to me? Do you know you can meet a very wonderful husband Where? in club? Yeah. yeah. And he'll be the best man you've ever met. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, and you can meet a wonderful husband in in church. So, mm. for me, or in or in the market. He's not that rich, rich. Mm, but he you might find it. someone who's not that rich, rich, but mm. with ideas that can help you build life together. Mm. Mm. With ideas but you can also find big. those people who are <laughs> 35, 40, 50, and their brain is nothing. There is a saying mm. in Uganda saying that the church too. That is yeah. very, very so true. So it is always better. So, baby fever, a colloquial term to mean the intense desire to have a baby. Now, I don't know, this is a feeling most of us women have experienced. Do the men experience it too? Is there something like daddy fever when you feel like, I really want to have a child? So these questions of when is it time to have a child? How, am I ready to have a child? Well, these are the signs to have a child. That's what we're going to be talking about, when to have a baby. In a bit, we'll be meeting my canal. So according to research, a woman in her lifetime could have more than between 15 to 30 babies. One woman. That's if she's really fertile. In my situation, I took more than 10 years to even have one after marriage. And the story is different for everyone. So today we're not talking about fertility or infertility. We'll be talking about when to have a baby. Welcome to the status quo. This show is about everything life, politics, religion, relationships. Name it if it affects you, if it matters to you. We will talk about it. My name is Jackie Dewey, the doctor's daughter. I'm a love and life coach and right now let's meet my awesome panel. We start with Carol right here. Hi, Carol. Hi, Jackie. Welcome to the show. Thank you. It's my pleasure to be here. Carol is a mom. Oh, yeah. And a wife? Oh, yes. Mom, mom of three. Mom of three. Yes. Boy, boy, girl, 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 boy. Two girls, girl. one boy. Girl, girl, boy. Mm -hmm. And next to Carol is a man probably that you have met before, but he's going to introduce himself. Mm -hmm. Banjo man here. Mm -hmm. Banjo mm -hmm. is a daddy. He's a daddy of? and still Indeed. wants to be more daddy. Did you say one more? <laughs> <laughs> of, of how many you have? How many? I got four right now. I got five now. Five? Yeah. Okay, oh. daddy of five. Still wants more babies. Yes. Still has daddy fever. Because I'm, Dave. I'm an African man. Are you an African man? So I'm such a bambali Uh-huh. And Debi. Yeah, Debi. Hmm? Nasanga. Debi Nasanga. Yeah. Okay. I'm single, not searching. Mm -hmm. Contented. And... Uh, <laughs> No babies. Okay. Yeah, no babies. No babies. Yes, okay, yes, yes. and her opinion also matters. Yeah. Very, very interesting. Welcome to the show, guys. Welcome to Thank that you. status quo. So I think I'm going to start with uh, Kara because she's next to me. So Kara, um, was it because you were married that you said, I am ready to have a child? Now I want to have a child. No. No. So well, how did you know you wanted a child? It was time. I don't think I knew that I wanted a child. Uh huh. I was in school. Uh -huh. Yeah, when I got my first baby, I was in school. Mm -hmm. So um, I got pregnant. Mm -hmm. And sometimes I wonder if that's what prompted me to get married. <laughs> <laughs> As in school, like high school, campus? No, no, no. I was at, at university. Okay, that's okay. Yeah, I was at university. I was, going, I was about to complete. Mm -hmm. So I got pregnant. Just and yeah. then we rolled into the marriage like mm. that. But um, I, I was sure that I wanted the baby mm. when I realized I was going to have the baby. That's when you realize that yes. you want the baby. Yes. How long had you been in the relationship? Like a year. A year, okay. Yeah. Usually they said, at least know someone for a year or more, then you can have a baby banjo. No, no. Mm -hmm. You don't have to. I I was sure I wanted the baby. I was not sure my boyfriend wanted the baby. But the, the baby came anyway. Yeah. So. Okay. So for you, you didn't even know the baby came. Yeah. How did so yours it happen? It's true that you fornicated. <laughs> it's not fornicated. Okay, let's go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> so banjo man the, 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 the preacher in him is coming out she's a witness, mm -hmm. she's a witness. Yeah. okay so mm. how did you know you wanted a baby or for you things just happened as well now mm -hmm. in African tradition mm. society mm. our children were a gift and still today they are gifts gift to yes, yeah, yeah, even know, in church uh, they act as uh, mm -hmm. They make life go on. You see? Mm. They come back into our okay. steps when we are gone. Mm. We this is the kind of a uh, theme we should not even uh, reason too much mm -hmm. because it is natural. The baby should come 
just for us should come for any time <laughs> huh? yeah man hey? i'm telling you so for you you are there and the first bone just pop spoon because human race would be <laughs> wouldn't continue if there are no kids and you see we shouldn't think too much mm. reason too much you see i have to work mm -hmm. and then after i prepare this and again, I have to do the oh, the other one is not yet. Let me hold on. Money, mm. you see, like you money. Are, you are. Yes, you are, you, you are, you are erasing people that would make weddings. You get <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> you understand? I don't know. I like I'm you. You're thinking for the future. Yeah. Children should come when I'm they come. It's okay. Yes. Yeah. No planning. Um, I had my first baby mm -hmm. um, when I was still at school. Women must also have decisions but when the baby comes mm. let the baby be. on the way unexpected mm. so you before 28 it's am okay. i wrong i think in this instance once you're having sex and you're having live sex Expect somehow, baby. If that, you should recover. expect the baby. Yeah, no, it's okay. No, no, it's okay. It is what it is. But it is mm, what it, it is. It is what it is. Okay, mm. we can call it making love. I okay. don't know. Okay, but once once you're young, once yeah. you're an adult, and but yes, <laughs> once you're having. Yeah, when, once you're getting exclusive with somebody, exactly. an adult, then that yeah. means you're ready to have a baby somehow. Somehow, if you're not taking any yeah. precautions. So right now, Deborah and Asha should totally abstain. I think so. Yeah. Of course, I am. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. Now, guys, let's <laughs> talk about the thing that most people say: yeah. money. They say, ah, you know, children are so expensive. I would love to, but ah, I'm not ready. And then even men and women say, ah, money. You see, right now, child, you know. Mm, I'm still renting. I haven't bought a car. Mm. No, I, I can't have a baby. The, the, do you need money? How much money do you need to have a baby? There is a very good medicine? point there. Mm. Because you just cannot have a child and then mm. you cannot provide for the child. Mm. So sometimes, though it's not like a main, main point, mm -hmm. if you don't have money, you can't have children. But no. Anyone can have children. Yeah. Once a child is here, mm. somehow, if you're dedicated to raising that child, mm. you, will, you will. No matter what. But, Perhaps. With the economy these days, I think you have to put it into consideration that will I be able, will I be able to take care of this child? Will I be able to feed the child, provide basic needs? Like how much should you be earning right now in this economy to qualify to be a parent? I'll not say that you like need okay to minimum, earn yeah, like I'm this amount of money because we all live different lifestyles. Mm. So I may talk depending on the lifestyle that I want for myself and my children and then it's not working for you Jackie mm. so and I think you're extravagant um, and I'm thinking not. no <laughs> do I need 200k per month for babies no exactly. that's extravagant exactly so yeah you may 50. call me extravagant mm. or you may say oh no 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 that's too below that's budget too below or something like so children. yeah if you think mm. that you can take care of yourself mm. you as Jackie mm. you can take care of yourself and there is some surplus for you to take care of another yeah, human it's being okay. Have a it's baby. okay, you can have a baby. Now, Banja, I don't know how to ask you this question. People usually define you as one of the richest men in town. <laughs> <laughs> so, how are you even going to answer this question? Emily? So, let me ask you. When you first had your first child, mm. I don't know if it's son or daughter. 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 How much money did you th do you f wish you had at the time? I had nothing. You mm. were in school. Let me answer the question. <laughs> because the question is not only about me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, it's yeah, it's, it's for everyone. One, yeah. Even mm. listeners. Mm. The Bible says, mm. you didn't know how you grew up. Mm. Mm. But I raised you anyway mm. into the person you mm. are. Yeah. A great person you mm. are. Yes. You get? Mm. Beautiful, charming. You get? Mm. Now, how would you question my potential mm. to raise that kid? From your finances mm. because you are poor mm. you get mm. now i grew up in the ghetto mm. where we had no food we are more than 30 yeah more than 30 children yeah of my father mm. but we grew up anyway you get and so he had your people Sometimes, sometimes yeah, we, we have to trust God. Mm. I don't know I have if I'm children, say God will take care of them. No. I, I don't know if I'm off topic. Uh, no, you are. No, to no, my, no, you're not my, off topic. My, it's your opinion. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Colleagues here, but uh, I mm. think I've got a point here. Mm. We have to trust God. 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 They say with one and it is have the child. Mm. You see, it is good to be having a job. Hey. But do not abort. I mean, because. Because the money is broke. Yeah. Yes. 
I have a secret you base. Might there is even another reason. chance. Yeah, sure. To, to, have to have another, another baby, baby yeah. get in mm. case the process goes, goes wrong, wrong mm. you might die that okay. could be your one egg um, with that poor person yes. broke person because of we yours. are talking about having kids a kid mm. Mm. again we are forgetting people are having what abortions no having mm. what issues having intercourse children. yeah mm. I, I, I would call it sex <laughs> <laughs> people are having sex <laughs> you get mm. Yeah? yeah, people are getting excuses. We are doing things let me get them. Kids are mm. in the scene. Mm. Yeah. They are mm. having sex behind the scene. Yeah. And then, of course, in every action, there must be results, repercussions. Yeah, there are. Repercussions. It's like uh, mm, unprotected that, uh, ch- child. Mean, Yes, having the child kids, STDs, you get yeah. children. Now, mm. since we are, we, are, we are talking about having kids, mm. let's also consider the fact that God is also giving this little beautiful creatures to us mm. to to you know to to, for to continuity raise. of mm. life mm. for for very many good reasons mm. you get mm. yes i think you must not avoid giving birth because you are poor yeah though all. you must put under consideration mm. that also preparing for the uh, uh, for for these kids not it's to not suffer cheap. or to face big challenges. Mm. It is always good to put something. On but on you. something, as I mean, refuse to come. Do not, do Don't not refuse die. yourself. Don't refuse chance. to have that baby. Yes, okay. Chances. So can I ask one thing, mm. Mm. Banjo? You you mean you do not have a certain quality of life that you want for your children? Right now, I do have. But before. But then mm. he had I, not. Yes, of course. So you, you had you, faith. <laughs> of course, I had faith. You even need to know the baby's just came. I was energetic. I was young. So you believe? You are just happy. Now that you're telling other for it happened, mm. you are not ready for the child, but the child happened, you accepted it well. Yes, exactly. If someone is listening to you right now and hoping to, to know mm. from you when they should be ready, don't you think they should put into consideration the fact that there is a certain quality of life I want for my children? Mm. And if I cannot afford it right now, maybe I should hold on just a little bit? No. I think that is good. Uh, that will when, never come. When, but when, if it never no, comes. when you started, you said that you had kid, a kid. Uh, yes. Unknowingly. <laughs> yes. But you are surviving. <laughs> you came here driving. <laughs> <laughs> you saw her. All I say is you have to trust. Go, you no, trust I, I was in school, but yeah. probably I was better placed than most students. Yes. Now you have to trust God again. Like those poor students, you know, also talk about like that. Eh? Mm. Many times you can say, "Yes, I have a, a kind of life I want my children to live," yeah. and you work, you work for it, but they, it's not coming. It's not coming. Mm. And time is like really yeah, like if Debbie, you hit twenty eight right now, yeah. and the music is not where you want yeah, it, you go ahead and have the go child. Go ahead and get married, have, have children. Because I have men who are willing to even marry. Get you married. right now? I tell you, I like yes, that. right now, and mm. they're well off. They are yeah. whatever yeah. they are. So but you think at twenty eight they'll still be around? No, even if they are gone, someone <laughs> will come. <laughs> Yeah, but let me also yeah, ask you, no does it matter if the guy wanted to have your child, you're now 28, you've pushed, pushed your music, okay, God forbid it's not doing what you wanted, mm-hmm. but he's not, okay, financially, okay, mm-hmm. that says the church boy, and you have a church boy. Of course, me, I will not have a church boy. You don't want? I don't want to have a church boy at because? all. Because? A church boy is a mm-hmm. disappointment. Mm-hmm. Mm, they huh. are. I think that is a big word. You say that is she's speaking. According she's a church girl. Preference. According from experience. From from she's a church girl. My so she's experience. from your experience. Mm. What have you seen these church boys do that you don't want them to have a your Those baby? guys uh, always think that the church will provide. They always think that God will provide. Yeah. Even if you're sick, mm. they say, let me pray. You need money to go to the hospital. This section is three million yeah. minimum, average. Yes, mm-hmm. so mm. church boys, no. So he'll pray the baby comes through. Yeah, until when they Force change. you to have a natural birth. Yeah. When the doctor says it's not possible. It's not possible. <laughs> I believe God is mm. going to help Debbie, us. where is your faith? Where is my faith in God? Mm. My faith is in God. No, like the man who keep wondering, where is your faith? And where is your faith? That's what they say. God. Yeah, sure. So me with God. church boys, mm. no, no, it doesn't work out. Banjo, you have had. never tried one. Mm. She's a church girl. She's a church girl. Mm. <laughs> She's a church, church girl. Churches don't. I mean, <laughs> I mean, they don't accept. 
<laughs> girls to have relationships but they're happening marriage. i i won't have a relationship without hey okay oh now <laughs> yeah. i'm guessing you Said you tried no. 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 no, 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 as long as you don't do bad manners, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can go ahead. And you and don't allow bad touch. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, what do you think you and your partner should talk about before having a baby? Because you see, oh, looks okay. like most people have had babies by accident. Okay. Yeah. They just mm, yes, have they have them. But if, if somebody is watching right now mm. and they're very you know that I do have a friend who is very organized, she organizes her life to that. Mm. Don't. Mm. And there are also people like those mm. who are thinking, okay, um, Maybe I have a job right now. My money is not so bad. Mm. Even if the guy was broke, I can take care of my baby. So what kind of conversations do you start having to, to show that, you know? You can have a baby. I think you have to first know the partner you have at the moment. Mm -hmm. Are they interested in having a child with you? What if he says no? Exactly. That's why Once a man you. says no, I think you should take him very seriously. And what if he gets you pregnant, but he said he didn't want a baby? You well, know when he so says that, that you just know that you're with the wrong person. Yeah. Yeah. Let's say if we are having, if we are having yeah. this conversation yeah. of I'm an organized girl, I have yeah. first had a job. I'm like Banjo, when I have your baby. Exactly. So now, yeah. if I'm with Banjo, <laughs> I'll, I'll talk about it with him. Banjo, I want to have a baby. And then he so says, no, I already says, have five kids. I already have five kids. I don't think. I don't then, want then more. Then I know that this is not the right father for my child. Yeah. Then by accident, you're pregnant. How can you even let that happen? When he told you he's... He has been with me. Maybe, Kachao, it, mm. it has already happened. So it I has already to happened. You that I'm now. pregnant. Mm. But if it has not yet happened, and I tell you, and you tell me I'm not willing, think, please, I think you're not. I personally <laughs> think <laughs> that um, love leads everything. And mm -hmm. if you love someone, mm -hmm. you can do anything. If Banjo is already married with five kids mm -hmm. and she loves Banjo, mm -hmm. she will endure whatever will come. Hey. And she will have hey. You have five kids and I don't have a kid a yet. A single child. Huh? I don't have any Deborah single child. Deborah doesn't love Okay? Mm. You have five kids. Mm. I don't have any single child. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's you I'm in relationship with. Yeah. I'm like, I want to give but You tell me you have enough mm. because... Mm. That's because you love thinking about no. yourself because alone. you love Banjo, you should be understanding. I should no, be understanding. This is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> you know, in, in, in the New Testament, Christ came for love, mm. and uh, he says that we, we should express love. He washed away all the mosaic and whatever, all the, the doors, the commandments mm. into one thing love. Yes. Love, you, you see, there. There are things that are powerful, mm. but love, mm. it can drive you to do something. Mm. In fact, love can also drive someone kill. Love if can is someone, blind. Yeah, if love can do that, mm. what about having a kid? Mm. Now, you, you ask the question, what are the things that must be in place for someone to have kids? Money. For partners. Mm. You cannot wash away the fact that money leads everything. Yeah, mm. of course. You mm. can't. Mm. Money is a very, very big factor of a family. And, and again, um, there is another thing that people do not even put under consideration. Mm. Um, the family. Mm. Family background? Or? Oh, oh, yeah. The, the person's family, right? Like exactly. Yeah. You see... Where, the, the, the guy you're dating or the girl you're dating? Things that we do oh, okay. yeah. will come into the kids that mm. you will have. Mm. Ladies tend to love their kids very much, mm. and those kids grow up, grow in, up in the manner that is not right. Those kids might grow up, and those are not the kids you expected to have. So as you a have, man, yes, <laughs> okay, not have. as a woman. <laughs> okay, hey. you get. Hey. If at all <laughs> in African tra traditional society we had um, this mentality of night dancers, <laughs> they are still there now. You date someone, you love him so much, and but then they are nice dancers. Yeah, of course, and they have those behaviors. You can pray for them. Kids. So, <laughs> as a matter of fact, you should also put under consideration mm. very many, mm. very many. Factors. Of course, I think when you start dating, you have to know someone's family. 
No. Not necessarily in this no, day and that's not the first thing you know. For example, your crush is all of them. You know where they come from. No, I don't know. Previously, we had Nyege Nyege mm. in Ginger there. Hey, people yeah. met. A lot of people met. Mm. We've got Bazongu. very many occasions around. People meet. You mm. get. Mm. If I can ask you how you meet with your partners, it might be one of the ways. Yeah. You cannot control how you meet someone. Mm. Now you don't know. Mm. You don't know their night dance. On heat. Mm. And then again, you lose your, your periods. Mm -hmm. Ah, you have to continue. Someone prove proves to be caring. I think Just like what you No, do. that's why as 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 a mother or a father, if you're going to be one just even before you decide to have a child or what you need to take responsibility oh. and and be careful with how you lead your life so let's say i've met so banjo at right. nyege you, nyege you shouldn't you should meet him in church no no by the way no mm. i never met my husband in church mm -hmm. so i'm not that person who will tell you and i'm not going to tell you stay home and you'll meet a man no, no. So, but if you're hanging out, I mean, if you're hanging out, good men right and places, good women, they're in the right uh, everywhere. Like where? Like you know, someone is watching, and they have been searching. Because I get a lot of people are saying, I have searched. Can you connect Jackie, me? Jackie, do you know you can meet a very wonderful husband in where? club? Yeah. Yeah. And he'll be the best man you've ever met. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, and you can meet a wonderful husband in in church. So mm. for me, oh, in oh, in the market. Oh, no, church, church, we, we have gotten scared. No. We don't want to every situation. I will not say that everyone is like that. <laughs> mm. Just like they say, where did you meet her? Like a man asked, where did you meet her? I met her in club. Oh, that one is not wife material. Mm. But then you go and they've made like the best marriage ever. Yeah. Mm. So for me, a place where you meet someone does not Doesn't really matter. Does not mat matter. Mm. But it's your responsibility to find out more about this person. Yeah, they... Especially if you see you're getting serious. Mm. Mm. You are having life intercourse a baby could happen so you need to know when no are they so you how know? do you know that says banjo since you brought up that topic no I how don't. do you know it was how do i know family. like okay not just versus but there are many other family issues yeah i think everybody relates to that what was, that's saying. just an example, yeah, that's yeah. Just an example. Mm. but how do you now we've met in the club we're already exclusive i mean i'm already Love. You're saying my body. How, love. how meaningful Very conversations easy. that will lead you to know some of these things. Yeah, and he might not tell you I some asked. things. Mm -hmm. uh, but um, as you get serious, mm. really, when they have but a family so function, auntie, offer to come. You get to know a person when it's with that she well, lock her up. For the record, I'm not a MCZ. No, 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 no. No, I, of <laughs> course, even if you could be one or you mm. one, I can't fear you because I have Jesus in me. You know? Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> What's your name again? Nasang. Because I wanted to add another wonderful thing on that name. Nasang. I would call, no, I would call Virgin Nasang. Because you said you are single. Yeah, she you, is. You, you must Our Virgin Nasang. Yeah. <laughs> and she's <laughs> representing that generation. Yeah. 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 Oh. Yeah. And you think it's okay. <laughs> but Banjo, that's not looking like Deborah. What are you? <laughs> what? I wish Even the guy that produces is scared. This is my machine to check it out. To check it out. Hey. But anyway, the only machine that, that takes mm. that thing is Jesus. It's the one that takes it away. Mm. Again. <laughs> now. <laughs> this is my paddle. Uh huh. You were asking me. Mm. Mm. So some of the things you could do, because on a serious note, somebody, you raise it and maybe somebody's watching the show mm. and they fell into some problems, spiritual issues or big, big ancestral issues they didn't know when they fell in love. Mm. And then they're like, I mean, you're talking about that happened to me. But how would I even have known? Because, you know, when you're young, you don't even think these things matter. All that matters is this person is taking care of you. They take you on good debts. And then you're like, you know what, he even bought me a car, I can have his child, right? Mm. From our African yeah. tradition, I think we realize it's us who are being careless. Our parents used to be very, very cautious oh, yeah. about where their children would get okay. married. Mm. They would want to know whose family, what yeah. do they do, do we mm. know them? Mm. Those were the reasons. Mm. But right now you meet a man mm. in Kampala, for example, I'm from Fort Porto, mm. my husband is a Muganda, so we met mm. here. Yeah. We met here and I did not know him, I did not know his parents, my parents, my parents asked me, where is he from? You said he's Amganda. Uh, he's Amganda, what do you know his family? Uh, and I was like, but my Does parents, I thought they are being materialistic. Hey. I'm like, oh, so you want big names? Like, I should mention like some guy who you know. I'm like, mm. some, 
they're like no we just want to know what do the parents do mm. where they come from what mm. they believe in religious mm. family yeah, yeah what do they believe mm-hmm. in and all that mm. i i and i was like mm. i i know a bit of all that they're like no you should know more i was telling them about my child before i could tell them that i was pregnant Hey. <laughs> then they started looking yeah, at so you. now they did not know I was pregnant. So like before you consider the kuchala and all that, it's a good thing. Mm, but, but first take time. know, before you accept You're this thinking, guy to huh? come, mm. take time first know where you see from. In my heart, I'm like, my parents you are materialistic. Know. They want me to get a rich man. Yeah. I was Kumbi. angry. Kumbi. Yes, and then my mom put me aside and said no Carl. if you're going to be serious with a man it means now you're leaving your family and you're going to live with their family mm. what if you reach there and you just cannot mm-hmm. what will you do so when i tell you to find out mm-hmm. it's for your own good mm-hmm. for your children's own good so yeah these days we meet men i can meet banjo banjo has bought me a car he has furnished my apartment mm-hmm. and to me he's the dream guy mm. But I think we should really take time to know if to, to look beyond. Yeah, beyond look beyond. This meet these people, see their beliefs. At times, eh, when you see something that is too good, if say like singer, you have to be so curious no. about it. Why yeah. is this guy really too no, good to me? There are some who are good, David. Mukwano. There are some who are good. Like uh-huh. you can meet you someone who is really, really good. Mm. I've ever met someone who takes care of me, takes care of my family, does everything. But when I took uh, like, time to understand, uh, yeah, an extra mile to know more him research, more dig deeper. and many things about him, I even got to know that he has a wife abroad. Yeah. Maybe what? are you getting me? So there are people who are really too good. They're just going to use you. Mm. I seen that company. spiritually. When when we also look into it spiritually, mm. that person can have things and whatever they can do anything for you. For rituals. Yeah, using you for rituals. Tell so, me, what type of man would you want? What type of man would I want? I want a, f- a man who is really fat. I want a man <laughs> who is a little older than me. Mm-hmm. Like me, right now, I'm 24. Hey. I want someone who is 25, who is 35, 36. Yeah. Yeah. I, I want someone who is a little old in the mind. Like you, you have not said it. I've, uh, which she kind of man? Yeah, which kind of man? God fearing, whatever. A wealthy one. Oh, of course, I want a wealthy Whoa. man. Yeah. yeah. 35. A man would one. have uh-huh. worked a little. A man at 35. Yeah. Mm. Think, like yeah really so you want it like a 35 year old man for now? Yeah, which is okay. Like if he was 40. But he loves you and loves Jesus. Yeah. But he's not like rich, rich. Who, who is like that? Like if the man is 40 years. Uh, and he's not that rich, rich. Mm, but he uh, you might it. find someone who's not that rich, rich, but mm. with ideas that can help you build life together. <laughs> mm. ideas but you can also find big. those people who are <laughs> 35, 40, 50, <laughs> 50 mkwan, or their brain is nothing. Mm. Yeah, the brain is nothing. Maybe he has also he has got many disappointments in life. He wants you to He's, build him. He at wants you to build him. You twenty four year old. Yeah, baby. how can I build <laughs> such a man? So that will be a great disappointment in life. But also, women are a great pillar in marriage. Yeah, we are. You see, in most mm-hmm. cases, they mm-hmm. do pray. Mm-hmm. They fight their battles by kneeling down and prayer. Mm. In most cases, that's so what I a forty year old Maya. person. Is that what you're telling me? No, no, <laughs> no. This is what I'm saying because yes. she said she wanted a worth one. Mm. I'm just showing her part of the story, the mm. contributions that she must at least... She must pray for that man's money. It is not only mm. consumption that you should do mm. as women. You get it. It's not only consumption. But consumption is one of that. Let that can, I, can I defend of course, myself? Of course, Let, me. Let me tell you this. When, when there is something yeah, there here. Is something. When there is something you when are... Love, when mm. money enters, love is sweet. Let me so tell you something. Thank you. Someone is only caring mm. when you provide. There, there are many people mm. who have said, let me build my relationship with my guy, and you mm. start from zero. Mm. When you reach there, mm. he lets you go. That is mm. are you getting possible. me? So it's yeah. better for me. Mystic. Try to be optimistic, work with your man. No, and what they be saying is, I'm like, she doesn't want to build a man, man who is going to disappoint her. Yeah. Let him make money and but come, and I come you hey, don't to maintain that. the money. She will maintain his money with She's her prayers. She's just reading about that. She has not experienced it. I've not yet. experienced yes, it. Yes, because you're 24. She has experienced it. Oh, what have you experienced it? That she you you give her a chance to say. She, she got disappointed. No, maybe she has it. seen something. Are you, are you trying well, to Debbie, what did you see? You no, saw like I might you saw not be the person who has really disappointed seen that, you. but there yeah. are many who have gone through such. Yeah. Like, who did you see that broke your heart? Like, you're like, no men, when you meet them, when they are broke. 
they live. Of course, I might have gone through such a thing, but I don't want to mention it here. Okay. But of course, things happen. You might not know. Behind yeah. the scenes, things happen. Things happen. And yeah. you don't say fornication because you're scared. Baby. Yeah. Mm. No, whatever. Mm. Whatever. I'm, I'm now yeah. used with banjo. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm okay. I'm a good yeah, man. Now, okay. let's uh, continue mm. like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In life, we make choices. Mm -hmm. And those choices affect us or build us mm. in life you get. Mm. Ah, in this kind of tough life, uh, many of the choices humans make are wrong choices. In the economy. Mm. Not in the economy. Mm. In the entire life. Mm. You see, the human mind mm. takes the illegality to be the interesting one. Mm -hmm. You get mm -hmm. where you can break the law. That is the, be the, the, the best it's even part better. of the story. You, you have fun. We all know from the beginning of time the forbidden things are the exactly. most attractive things. Mm -hmm. Of course. So, if I talk about choices, mm -hmm. it is kind of a hard word for having kids, for the family, the partners you are going to have. Yeah, it's all a choice. Everything is choice. A choice. Choice. Because yeah. you can regret. It is that something very made. tough, something you're going to mm. either live mm. with for the rest of your life, mm. yeah. or uh, it is that yeah. thing mm. that um, is going to damage you. No, you mm. will have one kid and go throw to that next. idiot mm. man away. Mm. You the go baby have stays another with one, you. That's you get the another beauty. angel. Mm. Of course, they are still, there is Jesus again, <laughs> maybe the angel, and then you will find God. <laughs> also, endurance mm. is part of uh, yes. life. Life for, for if at all you want her. Mm. because the kid will be happy seeing your father and um, mama together. Yeah, there is a saying mm. in Uganda saying that the word you are you call a bit banga or your puza. That is yeah. very, very so true. it is always better, you know. I normally uh, tell youths and uh, give them inspiration of how to work, how to develop, how to. We normally don't talk about these issues, but these are also important. Yes, yes. they are very important. As we talk about money, when you talk about the children, the relationships, because these are things we yeah. are actually yes. doing every and we are day. Yeah. Those are yeah. things we are living. We are living for anyway. We live so for let me also answer the question. You were like, mm. I want someone who is well off. Mm and I have nothing, or oh, where is me? Mm. Let me tell you, I'm mirroring an extent of saying I want someone who's no, well off. Maybe I'm also building myself for that person, for you that want. person mm. to find me when I'm also having something. You're adding not just something. Yeah. Not having when you're not just beautiful Deborah. Yeah, when I'm not just beautiful mm. Deborah. I'm mm. like, there are ladies value. there, there mm. are girls there, there are uh, mm. uh, female in my age, mm. but they are also working to find someone who will Add have value them and add value on what they are okay having. okay uh, guys it's it's been a very interesting conversation i don't even know if this conversation will end however <laughs> i don't know i don't know if you should continue with this topic but i feel like we've really exhausted most of the things that would worry us we've spoken about the money we've spoken about endurance talking about culture spiritual research something we don't care about these days we don't research anymore about who you're dating who you're sleeping with as long as you got high, got happy, or maybe they're good company. This guy has a vibe. Then you end up liking <laughs> the vibe. But that vibe, is it going to sustain you? And if you had a child with this person, is it even worth it? So, guys, next week I'm thinking we'll have a doctor on this issue and get a medical opinion. And also drop me a DM on Jackie Dewey, my Facebook page, uh, in case there's a topic you want to talk about or you want to be a guest on our show. And I definitely look forward to bringing back my panelists because I'm sure they've given us a good show and it's been really fun. And special thanks to my producer, Oga, who's on a camera moving up and down. He's everywhere, making sure the lighting is good, the sound and everything that you are seeing. Oga. Oh God, the boy. Yeah, man. So now, before I tell you to stay safe, because the ball and COVID are still here with us, our panelists are going to give us the final word. What each of you feels like maybe we left out or something you wanted to say, and maybe we didn't even bring up the question. Okay. Yeah, so who wants to go first? I can go first. Okay. So um, the whole thing was when to have a child. Yeah. So I think first thing you have to know is are you. Is your age appropriate to have a child? I think that's yeah. important. We hadn't and talked over. about yeah, mm. and we hadn't talked about that. Yeah, and uh, are you done with school? Yeah, personally, yes, I was still in school, but I knew that I was going to finish school. It wasn't going to You're graduating. Yeah, and then uh, am I financially able? Mm. And then 
is my partner willing to be in this together does with me? Does he want to have a baby with you or does he just want you for fun? Yes, because it is very imperative that you consider that you, you you are going to be present for your child and so is the father. Oh yeah. You don't decide for your child to be fatherless even oh, before yeah. they come around. Oh yeah, very important. So there is that. Mm -hmm. And then I think you can have a baby. If Any, anytime. Anytime. With that person. Yeah, there is a biological clock for us women. Yeah. Your but, trend um, is the best according to medics. Yeah, to have a child. That is, but still mm. Debbie who wants at twenty eight. Yeah, it's okay if you twenty eight and it fails, don't think that it's, it's over okay. for you. No. There's science, there's all those things. Yes. Yeah. So <laughs> Yeah, I think any time so, over eight. Maybe that banjo will go last. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Dewey, for hosting me. Mm -hmm. My name is Nasanga Debi. I'm a singer, songwriter, I am a TV personality. Follow me on different social media as Nasanga Debi. But then about the topic of the day, giving birth when, uh, to, when have to have a child. Mm -hmm. I also think you should have a child at any time, but don't think that I'll wait for me I'll wait to have the enough money so that I can give birth. When a child comes in, Munange, you raise that child, you never know she can be the minister or someone else in for the president. future. The president. Mm -hmm. The way my mom gave birth to us wasn't really in a good uh, a good the way. traditional way? No. Expected way? Yeah, it, it wasn't like really an unexpected way or uh, it wasn't the time that Obashi was rich enough to give birth to us. Mm -hmm. she, she gives a story that some of us even lacked what to eat, but oh. she, we survived. Mm -hmm. We grew, we are here mm -hmm. and we are happening. So mm -hmm. please don't lose hope that you're still poor, you can't give birth, please, if you feel like emyaka jikuleka, you can go on and have and a child. And to your people, your age mates, your... My age mates, please, I, 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 I would want to tell you that um, choose the right man, the person you feel like he can be the father for your kids. Who is the right man? Who is the right man? There are people, okay, there are people who come and pretend, there are people who come and they are real. Like, it's like having a rich man and a poor man, but this guy who poor is poor... Poor men can be real. No, no, yes, that's what I mean. Poor <laughs> men, nigger men are always real. Mm. This man who doesn't have enough money or that much money, mm. he can be there for you. Me, I've dated quite a rich guy and then that's the poor medium person. And they're different. Uh, they're different. Mm. Like, you can call a person, uh, this rich, rich guy, man. I really need some help, bichi mm. bichi, he will mm. tell you, let me look into my budget. Mm. And then this person, I need some money. Which the is rich really, one. The rich one will yeah, tell you, we'll let look me look at my budget. Then the, and I just go for three days mm. or two days. Mm. And then this person who is the just broke, medium, medium she, yeah. I just go gamba. No, right now I have 50, but I'll send you that 200 tomorrow, whatever. Like that. Zalina wo. Zalina wo zakuwa. Zakuwa. So they are real. So Na you think about it, no lava. Yeah, mm. no lava. Got this rich man, is a good father to your kids. Yes, mm. he has money, but he will not be available. He's mm. always you're not a priority. Business, business trips, which mm. is you're not a priority. Mm. Such as a man who takes you as a priority in your life, mm. in, in his life. The one life. who gives you most. Not who gives you most. Mm. He takes you as a priority. Yeah. Mm. Good girl. Yeah. Thank you. Banjo. Mm. The African man. <laughs> the African man. Uh -huh. Yes, there is a price. There is a price for all our actions, for everything we do. There is a price. It might be positive or negative, but there is a reward. Mm. Mm -hmm. You get having kids, taking care of kids. Sometimes some positive people might call it a reward, a positive reward, it a nice is, reward. It is a reward. It because is, once yeah. you take a look at the way your kid is looking, the, the, the way he's they're growing, playing, the growing mm. it is just a miracle yes. that is happening mm. in your life. Yeah. I'm just showing you how the beauty of, uh, of the God-given gift is. A, a child, that a child is. Yeah. In African tradition, society, or oh, in the Bible, they used to say that kids are flowers of marriage. Mm. Yeah. Today, it is not a because flower. if you go and wear, it is 50-50. Mm. The married men wedded people like this one. Mm. <laughs> Show the ring. Banjo wants the ring. Are 50%. <laughs> mm. Or even 30%. Mm. Mm. Marriages are pretty. But those people that are having kids without that mm. are more 90 yeah. percent you get mm. yeah what does Majority. that show mm. that indicates that um the chances matter. of get conceiving after marriage before, before marriage before marriage, uh -huh. or or 
because we're already expected. indulging in and these activities here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You get it. Mm -hmm. So let's just take the chance. Let's just take the price. Let's have the babies. Let's just have the babies. And they take your challenge. But it is always good to plan. Just like I said, everything has got a reward. You plan in a wrong way, things will come in a wrong way. You will look as your kid as a matter of fact, the person that, uh, I mean, hindered your success in life. If you do not plan. Mm. That happens always. Mm. We can mm. see all the kids, I mean all the mm. these women throwing kids in the toilet. Mm. We've yeah. seen this and the other. Mm. That goes without planning. Mm. I'm giving you both sides. Yeah, that's it true. is always, always and mm. always mm. better to plan. Mm. Plan today, mm. before tomorrow, before because tomorrow you don't know what to do. Yeah, have. so yeah, plan for today. True. I like the way she's planning. Mm. I just like the way yeah. I only can cancel her mm. like this. That um, you will never know that will come, and mm. it is always good to do things where well. you are energetic enough. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, having a kid, a kid tortures women. <laughs> you get <laughs> especially since you will never know. <laughs> we've, got the goes yeah. down. <laughs> we've got STDs on the way, we've yeah. got all, all sorts of issues on, yeah. uh, mm. waiting for you on mm. the way. We have pandemics. Before you face them, it is always good to drop something first mm. and then go and on. move forward. Mm -hmm. And then, after okay. you've done music, so Deborah is giving herself how many years? Three years? You say three? Yeah, three. Three years. Is three years you can do a hit not in, going in to stress her so much? You can do a hit in even a month. Even a month. It is good to be Which is okay. You when you get a hit, you, you, you do mm -hmm. another hit and another so hit and another hit. Three years is good. So I feel like it's too much pressure. I think you shouldn't relate yeah, too much uh, pressure. kids okay. with, uh, career. With, with your career. Your career. Mm -hmm. uh, if you get a right person, mm -hmm. but I think there will never be a right person. We are all not perfect. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, if you get somehow <laughs> close to your, 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 your dream, your desires, Take yeah, I that. think when you get someone who is kind, who has seventy percent of what is you need, interested, you can at least have that kid because you don't know what the future will tell. So when you make your hit, go ahead and give us a baby. That's and what Bajwa is saying. There, mm. You should stay in school. One of the importances of school um, is to hold on to you for whatever is out here. Mm. Whatever is out here is tough. Absolutely. It's unpredictable. Yeah. Life is brutal. You get. So education is doing a very big job to us. Yeah. To our kids. Mm. It is holding. They are ready, of course. They are mm. ready for marriage. Some are ready for you get. It's holding them. Some are eighteen. Some are they need to survive. It is keeping them in books so that we can you get. Mm. This one um can work, the other one can you get. Mm. It is getting them ready for everything. Otherwise, thank you and thank Mr. Oga, <laughs> Oga the producer, uh, thanks, uh, Madam Fumbo, <laughs> thanks, Madam Virgin, <laughs> Debbie, Debbie, <laughs> you get. I'm sure you've learned so much from the panel. I even have nothing to add. I feel like they've said it all, they've exhausted it all. And uh, if there's anything you want to contribute, I told you to find me on my Facebook page, ask me the questions, and Oga and I will be ready to bring you the next show. Thank you so much, guys, for making today really awesome and for making the time to say such thank important you for words. Us speak English. Are you welcome? Yeah. I thank personally you. hate that. So hate English. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much. See you next on the status quo. Bless.